So today is perfect day Coco Cay um, and we're just about to get some breakfast before we head on and we got another Royal Caribbean ship parked up right next to us. I don't know which one this is but it's a lot smaller than the Harmony. It definitely was a lot smaller than the Harmony. Now, there's a lot of smaller ships as well, but definitely when you're walking on the Harmony and you can see over this ship and you can see everything, it makes you realize how huge the Oasis class ships are. But definitely a cool sight to see when you wake up first thing in the morning, you're seeing another ship and you see how small it is compared to the ship that you're on. So you can see a side-by-side -side comparison between the Freedom of the Seas and the Harmony of the Seas. The Freedom is actually the first ship we went on on our honeymoon. It was actually cool, we thought it was big, but this one is way bigger. And this looks like the lineup to get on the tram. Um, it's crazy. Now, correction, this wasn't actually the lineup to get onto the tram. Um, this is just the lineup to, they check you so you get out of the area where the ships are docked and then you walk into Perfect Day Coco Cay wasn't that bad it's probably maybe like five to ten minutes depending on how fast or how slow you walk we just took our time because we had the little guy with us in the stroller but it was nice and breezy um it was a little bit hot but i can't complain when you walk into the park you have this area here this is the water park that you pay for and then you can go to the other areas where you can get the tram and different parts of the island we are here in chill beach perfect day coco Cay. Now the one thing we did when we actually went to the island is we got the tram and the tram literally takes you right around the island. But from the main entrance, Chill Beach is actually a short walk so you don't need to take the tram. And then the beach chairs, the umbrellas are included. You just gotta make sure you get there on time or early enough so you can get a spot. We were lucky enough, we got a nice spot. And the water is absolutely crystal clear. It's beautiful, the weather's amazing. Definitely hands down, I'd go to Chill Beach again. There's so much to do, so much to see on Perfect Day Coco Cay. There's the private islands, there's the water slides, there's a ton of stuff. We're gonna go get food and we're just chilling. It's actually really hot today in um, Coco Cay. So we're just chilling, taking it easy. Um, but don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel what at What's in the POT and hit that bell notification for new videos when we drop it. So let's go ahead and check out the food because you know I'm hungry and this is a food channel so we got to showcase the food but there's all different kinds of food and the best part is the food is included you got some desserts you got fruits and pretty much it's an open-air buffet it's kind of like the wind jammer you can see here they got hot dogs they got burgers barbecue chicken fries corn on the cob I'll, I'll tell you one thing that barbecue chicken was on point the corn was actually really good as well burgers pretty much similar to what you get wind jammer they got the sandwiches the cuban sandwich was absolutely delicious and you know me i had to go two or three times i had to sample a little bit of everything this is the topping station and if you love tacos as much as i do there is a whole taco station where they have all the different meats they have all the different dressings rice beans you name it they got it so definitely shout out to royal caribbean for making sure that you're well fed when you go to coco k and adjacent to where the food is is a little open air market so all these little huts um different vendors selling different things you can get different souvenirs tchotchkes um beach towels clothes you name it t-shirts so it's really cool, gives me a back home kind of vibe. I love the colors of the different stalls. So definitely if you're there, it's worth to go check it out. And this is us heading back to the ship and see how short this walk is. Instead of taking the tram all the way around, we literally just had to walk over that bridge and we were in Chill Beach. We're headed back to the ship. Did you have fun? Yes. He has fun. He's fast asleep. Perfect day, Coco K was a blast. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel at What's in the Pot. And also hit that bell notification for updates. And follow me on Instagram and TikTok at What's in the Pot.